Hello and welcome back. The Jewel Spoilers updates for Tuesday, October 20, reveal that the lights are going out in Salem. Clyde and Orpheus form a difficult alliance and more. All of Salem should be worried the night the lights go out because Clyde escapes and heads for Ben Weston. By the time Sierra Brady passed away, Clyde finally saw how much she loved Ben. However, Clyde is desperate to save his son on Days of Our Lives. Spoilers also show Dr. Rolf to be another convict on the loose, confirming the whereabouts of Days of Our Lives. Rolf shows up gun in hand at the Demera mansion, threatening Chad Demera. But why would Stefano's mad scientist go after a son like this? The third escapee back to Salem is Orpheus. He walks straight up to Marlena Evans and states that he needs her help. Crazy Dog's family predates her life spoilers when they see her go missing and know he's getting mad at the NBC frother. Jewel spoilers reveal that Clyde and Orpheus will soon both escape prison. The two villains form a difficult alliance. Now we already know that two inmates are heading straight for Salem, and they each have their own agenda. It's also confirmed that Orpheus will try to convince Marlena to go with him, but there's no way she will. That's when Orpheus has an idea. According to celeb Dirty Laundry, Henry could be kidnapped by Clyde. Now Clyde and Orpheus have already kidnapped, so why would Clyde take Allie Horton's baby? There's a specific reason, and it has to do with the partner in crime. Orpheus wants Henry for himself, but he needs this child to accomplish his fulfillment. Dual spoilers reveal that the only way more lady can go with Orpheus is if a loved one is in danger. The more innocent the victim, the more Marlena will do what Orpheus says and accompany him. Who is more innocent than an innocent baby, especially one he's, once he's her brand new grandson? Once Marlena realizes that Orpheus is Henry, she will do whatever he wants. Dual spoilers, Sarah and Xander argue. Again, yeah, it's getting pretty old for us too. We're going to give Xander credit. He's trying. He just has a short fuse when it comes to Philip, and he needs to get him under control. It's a good bet that Sarah will continue to lecture him on her behavior with Philip, and how she likes jealous and aggressive side towards him. We might even see an ultimatum coming. There's another possible strike against Xander right now. See Brady catches Philip conspiring against Xander. This can be done in several ways. Brady has very good reasons to dislike Xander, or Victor, especially now that Kristen is heading to Statesville. There's a good chance that Brady will be in this game as the injuries from Xander and Victor are said to be wide open at this time. Thanks for watching, goodbye, and see you again.